Hola, hola, I am Desiree Turbide, and today I'm going to show you how to draw this landscape. I painted this landscape for one of my workshops on how to paint a night landscape with watercolors. So I would like to show you how to draw it using geometrical figures. We will start by making a square, which is going to be the area that I am going to draw my landscape. Okay. First, we will draw the horizon, and that's going to be a very regular line. And from here, we will make an irregular line that's going to be the mountains in the back, way in the back. We will make here a triangle coming out of the paper because the tree is like really on, on the foreground. And we will make an oval for the shore of the lake. We have here, let me show you, some trees. All of these trees, pine trees, we can do just by making triangles and the ones here. Of course, the ones in the back are smaller triangles, medium triangles, and these ones in the foreground, this one in the foreground is going to be the biggest one, which is this one. So for the ones here in the back, I'm just going to make a set of small triangles and the ones here in the front, I am doing also like a different heights. Triangles, I mean, they can come out here. Now, if I am defining the lines that I just made, I'm going to make here like the shape of my trees, like this. This is just a sketch, for example. And so the shore, goes here. In my painting I made a couple of curves like here and then here just to show a bit irregular uh, shoreline uh, or the or I'm sorry the kind of the slope here and there the trees are here and these trees come here. Now to the big one, um, we'll just add the branches like this. And the other side, we have it also coming out here. And if it comes out of the paper, no worries. That's what we actually wanted. Really wanted to be a close-up of the tree. Uh, if you want to make, if you have space to make the trunk. So for example, like this, in your paper, if it comes up like this, that's okay. And now we have the other top of the other trees in my painting I did a tiny owl here sitting on the branch if you want to learn how to draw an owl you can watch uh, the video I posted on my channel so in this case this, because this format is much smaller, it is going to be a tiny one. And so I'm going to just make two small circles for the body and the head. We have the feet and the beak plus the eyes. So he's just sitting there. So, there you go. 
If you enjoyed this video, please help me grow this channel by hitting the subscribe button and the notification bell below. That way you won't miss any of my future videos. And there are lots of them to come.